Excuse me. This letter is this room. This is for your office? Uh, yes. Uh, okay. here? But here it says, uh, first here it says sixth. It's the first floor. First floor, or, or of a sixth floor. And now, look at me. So it's here, is this office? Six. Okay, okay. Okay, so you will uh, wait here okay. and they call. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Uh, your secretary took my paper. I am a teacher. I am a teacher. I am a teacher. I am a teacher. I am a Come with Just some appearance, just okay. I waited okay. for don't worry. I waited for two hours. Yeah. I can make more. The paper? paper is with them. Ah, okay. This is empty. Okay, that because it was for today, yeah. This is okay, for, no problem. It's for today. Okay, don't, don't worry, he said he'll see you. So. I mean, they summoned me for today. I mean, if yeah, he can, see he'll see you. Don't worry, he will see you. At least, at least it's cool in here. <laughs> Don't want to go outside at the moment. It's way too hot. Yes. One moment.
Sisters of Europe and Werner of Ferry. It's um, Thursday, July 13, 2023. Uh, as you can see, behind me is building number 9 at the Evelipizon Court. I was uh, had been summoned, Sapina, to be uh, at this court, office number. 106 first floor to supposedly testify about a series of incidents that happened um, back in 2021 August 18 at the premises of the Australian Embassy where I after they removed me from there they took me to the Sindakma police station where I had been assaulted and Many times, five occasions, by many police officers. Uh, I have, uh, I have um, cited the details of those incidents in my complaints to the Greek Ombudsman. So I was here to again, once again, testify about the incidents of those that day. I had before uh, summoned in another court behind the Supreme Court for the same reason as I gave my testi testimony there. Uh, here, I, the letter told me I had to be here at um, 12, which I was, but they kept me waiting until 2. First they told me that the interpreter, the interpreter came, uh, it didn't take too long for an interpreter to come. Uh, I think it came at half past 12, but then they still kept me waiting until uh, half past two, they attended to many other people and they get me for the last person. Uh, another just fascist behavior by these people. And then um, I gave my test testimony, but they were the judge who was taking uh, the testimony and the secretary. Well, the judge was very angry. He wouldn't. Uh, uh, take my statements, he was uh, accurately and he was making uh, asking questions and uh, making statements that had nothing to do with the incidents that happened on that day and uh, I don't know for the time being uh, I gave my testimony they didn't also give me certify that I was here in, in their office, I responded to their call so I don't know if tomorrow or another day they just say I didn't come and then they can do that. Uh, so. And uh, our all for the investigation, I don't know how this is going to end, if I will ever find justice in this uh, country for what they are doing to me. Trying to starve me to death, held in hostage, won't let me go. So, and now I also have to go to the Athens Bar Association if they are still open, uh, because uh, I have once again have issues with the lawyer who I've been assigned to my previous case. Uh, I want a written decision from the court. I asked him about it. He isn't responding to my emails, uh, three emails I have sent him three, so far, three times. So the previous time I had to uh, engage the Athens Bar Association in order to have him respond to my uh, my calls or my emails. Uh, I don't know if this time, how this time it will be, but I will have to now go to the Athens Bar Association if they are still open. Because it's half uh, past 4 p.m. and uh, I will see.